Hey folks, I want to do a really quick video here and just in the spirit of what I was talking about on a recent live stream about not overthinking things and, and if you think it, if it helps you, it can help somebody else. I want to show you something about um, these um, Citadel paints. I'm a big fan of Citadel paints and I've used them for years and I just I find them easy to pick up and, and I've learned to work with them. But as everybody knows, the pots are not the best part of this and the way that they all get gunked up and they don't seal and your paint dries out is one of the reasons people... Um, basically tell you not to buy them or, or to, to to get sort of other paints but I've, I've found a way to kind of clean them out and to look after them and I thought maybe it, it seems obvious to me but maybe it's not obvious to everybody else so I thought I would show you so first of all you will see that the main culprit is the way that these paint lids open up and the paint runs from the top it runs along the back of the lid there and down into there it basically dries and gunks up and then it stops it it stops it closing down and sealing correctly so what we want to do is i'm just going to get some paper towel because i make any mess on this one if you kind of hold it down by the base and hold it quite firm you should be pretty good with this i've got like a little sort of tool you can use a screwdriver or, or anything basically and what you're trying to do is you're just trying to get underneath the lip of that lid um and you're just twisting to to pull it up like that so that you can take the lid off completely and once you've got that lid off um, what I, what you should do then is get a bowl of warm water and it should be warm not hot we, we want it to be warm because we want to soften this plastic lid but if you get it too hot it, it deforms the shape so just just warm water just pop that in there while we uh, while we clean up here while that's softening up in there just take your screwdriver or your little tool and you want to clean around the edge of that lip there and just take off any of these um, little parts, oops, I just fell inside, I'll have to, I'll have to take that out. Uh, any of these little parts here that will um, will stop it from sealing again. Okay, and put that to one side. The next bit is take your, your bowl of water here. Um, and because this is now soft, you can turn this lid inside out. So sort of get a hold of it with your fingers on the edge and your thumb on the back and push to turn it'll take some force oh, it'll take some force but it will do it to turn it inside out and once you've turned it inside out, just just hold those edges back so it doesn't spring and you'll see that those bits have just just came off really really easily and um, just get your tool again and just clean around the edge here just to scrape those off it should just come straight off you can clean on the inside around around the lid here as well if you want to um, you can also clean the side but to be honest they don't matter so much it's more just around the edge where it seals so clean all those edge bits off you can if you want to I sometimes take an old an old toothbrush and just just run around the edge there you'll see the, the paint just sort of going into the water there and clean those off Um, and then once that's done just over the top of the water so you don't spray paint anywhere just push that back into its original shape right, I'll take that ball on one side now just get the get the tissue and just just dry that off a little bit and then let me just clear some space here take your paint pot again uh, pop that the edge over it again just pop it onto the clicks on there and then you should hear now when this goes closed you'll hear that little pop and you now have a perfectly sealed up pot of the citadel paint this will stop it going off it's something you may want to do kind of once in a blue moon and um, just to keep on top of it but um it just it helps the life of the citadel paint to last a bit longer and it's uh it certainly um is better than than throwing away dried out paints so i hope that helps one or two people if it has helped please do consider clicking the subscribe button and giving it a little thumbs up uh, and thanks for watching thanks for watching my video i hope that you really enjoyed it and if you did why not consider clicking on the suggested video below to see more of the work that i've done if you'd like to support the long-term sustainability of this channel why not consider checking out my patreon where you can pledge in support from as little as two dollars a month and there is lots of different tiers and bonuses which will give you access to a private discord server it will give you free t-shirts free mugs a podcast every month 
and a number of other things, including getting your name at the end of every video, like these awesome folks who already support me now. 